Welcome to the 2017 MIAA Awards Ceremonies. I'm pleased to be joined right now by legendary MIAA head coach Bob Chipman. Bob, thank you for taking the time. We appreciate it. Uh, big award night here tonight. Just talk about the great accolades here with the MIAA Conference. Well, it's, it's great. I mean, I really appreciate it. Uh, a lot of fond memories. Um, it's just gone by way too quick. I mean, and uh, MIAA is a great conference. Uh, be recognized by this conference, by the people. Uh, it's just a tremendous feeling. Certainly had a lot of great years uh, as a head coach here in the conference. Are there any games in particular that you can really think back on and you know that really stick out of the rest? Well, um, in the conference, uh, yeah, just any time you could fight your way, uh, you know, a championship game, get the cut the nets down. There were so you know had ten of those. Uh, I think the games probably in Kansas City, the last championship with my son, uh, cutting the nets down, winning the conference championship. Uh, I think that was what five years ago. Um, that's the one that really, uh, I think, is extra sweet. Now, and it's something extra sweet, obviously, has to be playing at Municipal Auditorium here in Kansas City. Such a historic venue for college basketball. What's it like being able to coach in an arena like that? Um, well. It's tremendous. I mean, I think it's one of the great things that our conference does. I mean, everybody looks forward to going there. I think it's tremendous for the conference, tremendous for our young people. Um, so I, we were always just everything kind of centered toward that. You're fighting to try and, you know, get to Kansas City and, of course, try and win it and to play there. You know, I played there as a player when I was at Kansas State. So I go way back. I broke one of Wilt Chamberlain's records. We're not going to we're not going to get into that that record, but uh, you know, tremendous uh, tremendous venue and so many great feelings there for me personally. Absolutely, and uh, one of the last things I've got for you: what's next for you? Obviously, coaching is uh, certainly uh, on the back burner for you. What's next? Well, my daughter um, is pregnant with twin boys, so uh, she's going to need some help. And uh, she called and told me, she goes, Dad, your coaching career's not over yet. Got two twin boys coming. So we're looking forward to that. First time grandparents. So we're going to be pretty busy with Kelsey helping any way we can. Congratulations on that, Coach. Best of luck with them. Uh, last thing for you here real quick. Obviously, you couldn't have been able to have such a great coaching career without some of the other people around you. I'm going to give you the floor here to thank whoever you'd like. Well, my family. I mean, without question, my family. I mean, uh, Carol. I uh, proposed to her at an athletic banquet early on and uh, said something like, we're negotiating a lifetime no-cut contract. She's been with me forever. She's turned down a lot of things just to be kind of one of my assistant coaches. Bobby, uh, born the last day of the season, played for me, coached with me. Kelsey, born the first day of the season, um, probably my best fan ever. And the, my family has been there from day one and uh, couldn't have done it without them. So it, it starts there. Head Coach Bob Chipman joining us here. Thank you for the time, Bob. We appreciate it, and congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.